Well, the African-American man at the center of a controversial confrontation in Royal Oak is speaking to 7 Action News. Now, in a video on Facebook Live, it shows police questioning the 20-year-old. He says police were asking why he was looking suspiciously at a white woman. 7 Action News reporter Ali Hoxie joins us live this morning. And Ali, we hear that this uh, man is meeting with Royal Oak Police today. Yeah, that's right. Devin Myers says he and his attorney have an appointment with Royal Oak Police to talk about this now viral moment. I am in Royal Oak, Michigan. I was um, going to the CBS over here when this young man is stopped because a Caucasian lady said that he looked at her suspiciously and he has been pulled over walking to go to eat by two police officers for suspicion of being black. It was a bystander who took this video. The man at the center of the video, Devin Myers, says four officers responded. He says the officers demanded to see his ID. Myers says the owner of In Season Cafe, where the incident happened, also advocated on his behalf. I need to make that like a parking sign for you. Look, don't stare too long. No, don't be black and stare. I never would have thought racism was amongst the urban cities because I have tons of white neighbors and they all like me. So that's, I've never really paid racism that much attention. All right, so Allie, we hear him. What is Royal, what are Royal Oak Police uh, saying about this incident? Well, right now they've declined to comment, but have confirmed with 7 Action News that there is an internal investigation looking into this. And the mayor of Royal Oak actually sent us this statement. I want to go ahead and read it to you. It says, in part, we are passionate about being a city that lives and acts according to our values and one where all people from all walks of life, from all racial and ethnic backgrounds, feel not just safe, but welcome and embraced as a member of our community. You can read that full statement on our website at WXYZ.com. Ellie Hoxie, 7 Action News.